Um, and they, so the Justice Department had everything. And you would think in, in a year they'd be able to look at everything that I had. Uh, I wasn't hiding under the speech and debate clause. Uh, they had everything. You'd think in a year they'd, they'd understand that there's nothing there. Uh, and I, I think the thing I learned the most, Wolf, is, it, I, you know, I, I just, um, I'm not mad because uh, they thought I was corrupt. I'm mad because they thought I was stupid. Uh, I knew they were after me, and I had uh, lawyers uh, uh, all the day long telling me what I could and could not do to make sure that uh, none of this could happen or, or that I was uh, living within and working within the rules of the House and, and within the law, and uh, I've been proven right. How much did this cost you in legal fees, this federal investigation? Well, I don't know. Uh, the federal investigation alone cost me over $500,000. The uh, racketeering suit cost over $5,000. The several ethics charges all dismissed, by the way. So a, a total we added up over an 11-year period was $8 million in legal fees. Eight, you, out of your pocket, you had to spend $8 million to defend yourself? No, I don't have that kind of money. It did, it did empty my bank account, but luckily the, I have supporters all over, all over the country who appreciate uh, me standing up and fighting hard for conservative values, and I was able to raise most of that money. Wait, so let me do The $8 million figure is what? That's that what the federal government spent, or is that what your legal fees were? That were my legal fees over an 11-year period of several ethics charges, a racketeering suit, this, this federal investigation, the uh, indictment that I'm under right now, um, all total up to over $8 million. Can you imagine over a six-year period uh, what the federal government has spent in uh, lawyers and FBI agents uh, investigating me to no avail? And you still have these, these state charges that are pending in Texas. That's going to be coming up for adjudication within a few weeks. Is that right? Actually, I go to trial next Tuesday. Um, and I'm looking forward to it. I've been waiting five years to go to trial. I, I, I could not get to trial, and that's a, a long story, but uh, we're finally going to start the trial with a pretrial hearing on Tuesday. Hopefully I can get before a jury very quickly because I was, uh, uh, I was indicted by a runaway rogue district attorney uh, and indicted on laws that didn't even exist in Texas at the time. After six years, Tom DeLay uh, will not face any federal charges. That investigation is over with. Uh, 